All right, happy Memorial Day, everybody. Uh, I've been playing with this Mach 17, uh, two Mach 2 17 caliber rifle, and I used to play with an HMR rifle, 17 caliber a lot, and I got away from it, and I've got back into this Mach 2. So I got a little tip here, maybe some folks want to try. I like to be quiet when I'm in the woods, so listen to this. Now, that's an old factory full box of shells, and that's the Hornady variety. Here's the CCI with some missing. Hear that? Bad. Makes a lot of noise. Okay. Here's a box here. I'm going to hold it up to the camera. I've got this, these inserts right here. Okay, I shaved around this thing real small because this box is tapered. So the first couple will have to have a lot more shaving done on them versus the third one. The fourth one won't need any, but listen to this. Here again is a big difference, okay? Now you can get away with three layers in here of these. Here's one here that's got two, and I can add this third one in here, okay? So you'll have to experiment a little bit. And you're going to have to take a Dremel is what I use. See these stops in here? Okay, you're going to have to drill them or uh, cut them stops down a little bit so you can put your layers down in there. You see that maybe in the camera right there. I've got four in that one there. Okay. You can get away with three if you if you don't if you cut these off the right length so you get a tight fit up here on top and you need to check your lid with a shell, you know, cartridge going in. It needs to it needs to be somewhat firm. But that right there is real good. Real quiet too compared. Now, this long rifle CCI uses the same thing and you'll see a little line there in the middle. You can break these in half and use them in these boxes here with this Mach 2 okay and uh, but now these cases here you know they're noisy too these old cci long rifle you hear that that's a noise box right there too so you can do these the same way you have to cut the stops build you some layers so save your old ones and you can make you some of these the only thing i caution you against is like i've got Mach 2 um i've got these here so if you want to use one of these for like 22 long rifle, you need to have them labeled so you don't mix your shells up. You know, you don't need to be a put trying to force one of these in a, you know, by accident and vice versa. Okay? I just thought I'd share that. Hope you enjoyed the video.